Hi and welcome. Today we are going to review Green Shot Elf. Uh, it's a great two intercept, 9000 power, one critical, 5000 shield. Uh, Neo Nectar. The flavor text is The elves do not forgive those who lay waste to the flower garden. Hmm, pretty cool. Uh, it's a new ability Bloom, which we're going to see most cards have in this set, so it's going to be interesting. It's a generation break one. When your other unit named Greenshot Elf is placed in RC, choose up to five units named Greenshot Elf on your RC until the end of that turn. They get plus five, two thousand and boost. So this is a really interesting card because uh, when you place another uh, another unit named Greenshot Elf on your RC, you can activate this effect and they get plus two thousand power and boost. And you can do that up to five units. So basically, all your rare guards, because you can have only five rare guards. So yeah, if you get four of these out in the field, and you can uh, summon some monster that can clone another card, uh, I think another card in this set. I'm gonna go over in, in in the next that can do that. So if you can get that out with four of these, you can get 2,000k plus boost. So, and people don't know, boost is uh, when you can when you boost your the attack of the monsters so that's pretty damn cool though so i think this card has a lot of interest because of its ability and it's so easy to do and even if you just have one and you summon another one you can activate it so it says up to five so you can choose um of course how many um, green shot elves so if you have three you can activate the ability but at least you can activate if you have two on the field, so that's pretty good. Uh, even if you summon one and you can clone that, you can still activate this effect, I believe. So that's pretty damn cool. And 2000 plus boost, that makes this card on 11k. So that's pretty, that's pretty good. And it has boost, so it becomes even more powerful. I think that's uh, what this card is really good at. It's a really good boost card. And it's a really good attack card, so you can put it in your front row or your back row. Uh, I would probably put put it in the back back row just because it can boost the front row, and it had becomes 2k. Uh, and yeah, that's pretty much it of this card. It's an amazing artwork, of course, and a really cool effect. Really interesting. So tell me what you think about this card, and comment, like, and subscribe. 